I went into the U.S. Army in 1944, and uh, I ended up in Europe during the war. And I was in the 740th Tank Battalion. We were attached mostly to the 82nd Airborne, and uh, I was assigned to the assault gun platoon originally. I ended up in the communications part of the battalion. On VE Day, 1945, uh, we we had ended up at Schwerin, Germany. Schwerin is up on the Baltic. Uh, we had been set up to help the British, and we found out later on it was to prevent, help prevent the Russians from taking over uh, in Denmark. Everybody was pretty much happy, and uh, no, no bullets fired in the air or anything like that. I think it was just everybody was tired and glad that it was over, tired, hungry, and dirty, so they wanted to get cleaned up and rest. Well, of course, 75 years is, is puts a long handle on the darn thing, but what it means to me is it was the end of a lot of hard times and struggles, and of course, we, we were all victims of the Great Depression, and then we had the, the war to contend with, and so... The E Day meant the end of a lot of struggle and a lot of heartache and a lot of nasty memories. That uh, that's that's what comes back to me every every year uh, on the E Day. I always think of the, the numbers of guys that were left in the ground over there, and uh, even today they're still just 18, 19 years old, as the rest of us are in our 90s, and that that's hard to take.